Well, welcome back. I thought there's something here you might want to see. Some of the ships we have to stay out of the way of, but if they're anchored, we can get a little bit closer. Just waiting to go in, I guess. Looks pretty full. Pretty full. Massive thing, just totally massive. Okay, we're probably still uh, like three quarters of a mile off. If I actually sailed over there, you'd see that the mast wouldn't even, well, it might get up to the deck, but. Maybe the mast would get to the top of the containers, I don't know. Anybody knows how high the containers on the deck of a container ship are stacked, I'd be very interested. That bridge has got to be 150 feet up in the air. HMM Stockholm. Here we are, we've got another wind farm coming up over there. Really nice conditions. What's interesting is that the wind here actually should be from the east. The weather information that we looked at before we set off said that that weather system was going to sit over uh, Cornwall, over the, the southwestern tip of the UK. But what we're getting now, we're getting uh, this is like 15, 16, maybe gusts of 20 knots coming in from the west, which means that weather system has come over which I'm going to be very interested to download the weather then and find out has the, oh, I'll try and block the sun out for you a little bit has that weather system shifted away from the south west where we were going to go and left a big void there which is very very likely or has it, have, have we got more from the north which then would have been a flipping disaster trying to get north with a northerly breeze so it would meant we got to the uh, the corner of um, uh, Cornwall and then turn north and the wind came from the north so we were beating, beating, beating but here we go, we're getting closer and closer and in this situation even though it's obviously stationary I am aware of the fact that there's tide running there's like two knots of tide under us at the moment pushing us along and I'm also very aware of the fact that uh, she can surge forwards and backwards on her anchor chain amounts that might surprise me to the point that I'm actually just putting an extra 10 degrees on the uh, on the autopilot there you could also end up with uh, aerodynamic effects around the front of the ship it could be quite unbelievable well there's one thing certainly we didn't go to the the west we decided to come this way and one of the things I said was it'd be more interesting, it'd be more to see. Look at that. Wow, wow, wow. It's been a long time since I was that close to one as well. Just coming down 20 degrees now so we can see more. Oh, Korean, Korean script on the uh, side there. Fantastic. 